So we're going to talk a bit about the category system or the cat ball system. It's a system of uh, balls and pins that helps you connect implements to tractors and it is a, a one-way safety system. The system's designed so little tractors can't use big heavy implements but big tractors can use big implements and smaller implements. So this is decided by what size category ball the tractor takes and our two tractors here we have the smaller red case which is a category 2 system and the larger New Holland which is a category 3 system. There's a smaller category 1 system that's normally used on little hobby tractors and old fashioned little Massey Ferguson's. Uh, the Cat 1 system which I have here is usually a captive ball system so the balls are usually permanently attached to the tractor and normally the implements are so small and light that it's generally easy to move the implement to fit the tractor uh, so generally that's why they're connected like that. We have on the bigger machines we have a semi-automatic catch system where the balls are separate from the machine and that's the Cat 3 ball and the Cat 3 catch and if we try to put the smaller catch in there it will just fall out. Right. Now, so the little tractors can't use the big stuff because the balls just don't fit but we want to have some way that the Cat 3 tractors can use smaller implements so we can do this in several ways. So that is a Cat 3 ball with a Cat 3 inner and that is a Cat 3 ball with a Cat 2 inner so it's the same outer diameter but it's been thickened out so this can now fit a smaller implement. We can achieve the same uh, result by sleeving so if we don't have the smaller ball we can use the original ball and put an insert sleeve which then allows us to use the smaller pin. Okay, so that's the category ball system. Designed, like I said, one way safety system. Big tractors being able to use all the implements, but it prevents little tractors trying to use big heavy implements. Now, we have three implements here. We have a power harrow, which digs in the soil, a fine mowing deck, and a topping uh, weed cutting deck and they all have three different systems for attaching to the tractor. On this machine we have a solid three point hitch so the top hitch and the bottom hitch are all in a vertical line and there's no variation in that and you normally get this on machines that dig in the soil so they attach all three points to the back of the tractor and the tractor can force that down into the ground to dig and raise it back up again. With mowers we have a flexible hitch on the top, so we have the bottom hitch solid and a flexible top hitch. This allows us, when we raise the machine off the ground, the ch chain goes tight and you can lift the machine off the ground, but then when you get to the site and you want to work, you lower it down, the chain goes slack. And that means the tractor can follow the contours of the ground and the implement follows separately behind it. If we had this attached, like the power harrow with a, a solid three point hitch. Every time we went down a ditch with the tractor, the mower would lift off the ground and every time we went up a hill, we'd be trying to force the blades down into the, the grass. So with a machine like this, we needed to follow independently. Over here we have a two point hitch system, which is a similar concept to the flexible top hitch. But basically, it has no top hitch at all. The arms lift the deck up forcing onto there and forcing down on there and the flexibility comes from the pivot point there. So that's our three different types of pitches.